Have you done any world PvP in Legion? If you are a rogue, I recommend you to try world PvP, especially if you are going to be doing a subtlety rogue. I mean, technical assassination is just as good and outlaw is not that bad, but subtlety in particular is actually a lot of fun. So with the whole nerves that are coming out in the future, I've just been actually enjoying my rogue even more. Partially because I'm thinking I might as well enjoy the rogue now before these nerfs hit me like a fucking truck. Fun story, these nerfs are gonna hit harder than rogues have been able to in the all of patch 7.1. I'm kidding, but not really, <laughs> these nerfs are gonna suck. But if you haven't tried world PvP, I think you definitely should. I feel that world PvP, because it doesn't constrict to the PvP templates with all the agility and the stamina and how much damage everything deals and the massive reductions that Blizzard have done, I feel like it actually makes PvP really enjoyable. And I guess it's really really strong from a rogue's perspective, but it's also very much fun. I think that's the best part about it, is this is actually fun. For the most part, World of Warcraft for us have been a game that has been um, defining the word balance in some of the most weird and awkward ways. Sometimes it's awesome and it feels like, yes, the game is fairly balanced. You know, there's a few uh, screws and nicks loose here and there, some classes are hidden a little bit too hard, but for the most part, it's been satisfactory. But that usually happens towards the end of the season, so towards the end of Legion, I'm hoping all the classes will be fully balanced out as gear progression and item level all go up and increase and more adjustments are made in the future. But for the time being, we can't really do much if Blizzard is nerfing certain talents and certain abilities and uh, certain agility numbers and percentages in PvP for BGs and arenas, but we can still take it into World PvP. Now, I feel like if World of Warcraft PvP were what World PvP is like, I think to a certain extent it'd be a little bit more fun. Maybe minus a few agility or trinkets and maybe strength trinkets that are in particular really, really powerful. I think that would be the PvP that I really would enjoy. You know, this really clutch moments where so much burst and so much damage goes out that it's really hard to maintain and manage it for the most part where healers have to pop their defensives and spam heal in order to keep their friendlies up, where every single class feels very bursty once they pop their cooldowns, where subtlety actually feels like it has burst during shadow dance, when you're able to stun lock your enemy and deal decent damage to them during the stun locks, you feel so powerful, rather than feeling like a CC bot hitting the enemy with a wet noodle. I mean, granted, there are a lot of other classes that can do world PvP a little bit better than we can, Frost Death Knights, for example, can almost one-shot you with that Sintra Ghost of Flyby. Then we have Woundwalker Monks with our artifact weapon that can hit you for over a million was to pop all of their cooldowns, so you drop down very, very quickly. We have some Frost Mages and Fire Mages that can literally blow you up from range. We have Hunters, especially Beastmaster Hunters, that destroy you at range completely. We have some rogues that can run subtlety and do some crazy DFA build where they will crit you for over 2 million damage in a single global and it's all fun but it's also unbalanced but does that balance really matter and that's kind of what i want to talk about i feel like with world of warcraft what's been uh one of the greatest things about it is just how fun the game has been it doesn't matter if there's any form of balancing it doesn't matter if the game is balanced to any extent at all for the most part as long as the game is fun to play and fun to press your buttons even though it might be unfair at times it still doesn't really matter it's almost like gambling right where you lose every single time, but you're having fun gambling and it, no matter how many losses you're taking, how much money you lost, you kind of just want to keep going at it to see your luck, try your luck again, because you can sometimes get that big win and then maybe you go on a losing streak and then you get big that, that big win and it's, it's a bit more RNG, but nonetheless, it is still fun. And I know the Blizzard is trying their hardest to balance all their classes and all the specs as best they can, they're constantly making adjustments and as patch 7.1.5 goes on, there'll be for sure a lot more adjustments happening to a bunch of classes. The classes that are doing too much damage, maybe have too much mobility, are going to be toned down slightly. Classes that need more mobility will probably have some options, maybe some talent switch around. So I feel like I can trust in Blizzard and to see that they'll probably try to make the best balanced PvP experience ever. They already have the tools implemented. They have the honor talents added, they have the stat tempos that they can modify. They also modify the damage of certain abilities in PvP, and I feel like this is the most amount of balancing tools Blizzard have had in terms of PvP. All we can do is kind of sit and hope that the right guys make the right tunings and turn the right dials in order to change the damage in the game. 
to be as balanced as possible. But for now in PvP, what you have is unbalanced just shit fast. But it's so much fun. And I feel like this is where Legion kind of lost its way in a little bit. For the most part, Legion is a great expansion, and for the most part, the PvP as of patch 7.1 is still a lot of fun. I'm currently enjoying playing all three specs of Rogue, Outlaw being primary, then I would say Subtlety is second, Assassination is third best, but not like it's, I hate it, it's just the third best on the list, because I, I just like the mobility of Subtlety. So we have Outlaw, Subtlety, Assassination, and also have a Demon Hunter. I have a Demon Hunter, which is a blast to play all on his own. So I feel like they have a pretty balanced expansion so far in patch 7.1. We'll see how the next patch uh, comes out after the changes uh, go off. But it seems like some of the elements of fun and randomness and random damage, just basic things that I used to remember for World of Warcraft being, you know, that's what made the game super fun for me at the time. They're not wide fully there anymore. I'll give another example. During Mr. Pandaria, I played Combat Rogue. <laughs> no one asked me why I did it. I enjoyed the live in hell out of combat rogue back you miss a pandaria one of the things i like about combat rogues is their mechanic of red buff red buff was the mechanic that was basically not all too viable and not a lot of players preferred to play with it completely understandable as it was just like one of those really i guess low brow mechanics and eventually just wasn't all that great compared to that over subtlety rogue especially during pandaria it changed the tables a little bit during Warlords of Draenor, but in Pandaria, definitely combat was one of the least played specs. But what I liked about it, even though it had low damage output, even though it didn't have the same utility as a subtlety rogue, it was still the spec that no one wanted to play, as it was simply just not the best spec of choice. Because of the red buff mechanic, which was literally what let you win, it gave you this kind of playstyle that you had to really be patient for, really build up for. But once you hit it, there was a moment where it's like, oh, I'm having fun, I'm dominating, I'm dealing the max amount of damage. So it was a spec that was terrible at basically everything. It was the second, even third best at everything. But during that moment, once you get red buff, oh, it was fun. You knew that you had it, you knew that you were winning. And I feel like with Legion pruning abilities and changing how some classes function, maybe some classes just lost the ability of like, okay, this is my time to shine. And this is my time to have my fun. And I feel like we are trading out balance for fun, or I guess we're trading fun for balance. Is that a good thing or not? Let me know in the comments below, guys. Go out, do some world PvP. Trust me, you'll enjoy it. My name is Dallin. See you guys in the next video.